A man bigger than himself serving more than 500,000 meals just last summer, stepping up his mission once COVID-19 began to spread the thing he would die from. But they say the work must continue, not forgetting who Rafael Hines was. He was a giver. He uh, always wanted to make sure that those around him were supported uh, with whatever they needed. More than three decades of serving, food, school supplies, tutoring, parental support, guidance, a way forward, all out of his own pocket after being paralyzed from an accident. This earth is now um, void of somebody who was a, a, a picture painter. He, he, he allowed these students to see um, what was possible. At the heart of it all, the youth doing everything in his power to show them they had potential. Mr. Hans was more like a father figure in my life. He's been knowing me since I was very young, and I've been working with him in the food program for six or seven years. Hines partnering with employment partners throughout KC to give jobs to those in need, aligning with the Urban Youth League to pass out opportunities for those who needed them. And give them a space and opportunity to have something else to do other than being out in the streets or being around the wrong crowd. On December 31st, Rafael Hines passed away after a short battle with COVID-19, leaving behind his wife and 19-year-old daughter. But his team is determined to ensure the work continues. People to come together and help finish the vision that he had because this is only the beginning. If you would like to help in his vision of feeding kids across KC and the many multifaceted programs he ran, you can go to fox4kc.com. In Kansas City, Missouri, Malik Jackson, Fox 4, working for you.